Hello everyone, in this lecture we will be solving 1988 AME problem number 7. Here's a view of this problem. In triangle ABC, the tangent of angle CAB is given as 22 over 7. The altitude from A divides line segment BC or side BC of our triangle into lengths 3 and 17. And we would like to find the area of the triangle. So let's go ahead and make a quick sketch of this shape. So we have our triangle something like this. So we are given A, B, C. This is our triangle. And we are told that the altitude from A divides BC. So I go ahead and drop the altitude from A to BC. And let's call this point as D. So what I know is BD is 3 and DC is 17. Let's call this altitude as H. So we are given that tangent CAB is 22 over 7. CAB would be the whole angle here. We realize that it consists of two angles here. You can call them alpha and beta. So therefore, um, 22 over 7, which is equal to tangent uh, CAB, is the same as tangent uh, alpha plus beta, actually. Now I can go ahead and uh, use the addition formula for the tangent fun function. I get tangent alpha plus tangent beta all over 1 minus tangent alpha tangent beta here. And from here... Um, obviously, I can, by just looking into the sketch, I realize that tangent alpha is simply 17 over h, uh, 17 over h, and tangent beta is simply 3 over h, 3 over h, so we have 1 minus 17 over h, and then 3 over h. So from here, all we need is to solve this equation, so, um, so that, that would be equivalent to 22 over 7 which is equal to we can we have a common denominator here 20 over h on the numerator and uh, in the denominator we have h squared minus 51 i believe uh over um h square um so we can make some cancellations here this h and that square will cancel out so therefore this uh, ratio would be equal to 20 h over h squared minus 51 we can therefore finally do cross multiplication here and so once we do the cross multiplication and uh, organize things around so we have 22 h squared minus 140 um, h uh, and then 22 times 51 so let's just leave it as it is actually times 51 and that thing is equal to zero we can factorize uh, so uh, we don't have to use the um, the quadratic formula, I hope. So therefore, this implies that h is simply, uh, so the only positive one is this one, 22 over 2, which is 11. And as a result, the area itself of our triangle um, ABC is simply base times height over 2. So 20 times 11 over 2, which is 110. That's our answer, and we are done.